Leave it 851, turn right heading 180. 14 Papa, turn right 245, report local light established 27. Hey everyone, welcome back to DJ's Aviation. I just want to let you all know that I am recording this from London with a very basic headset at around 5am. So that just happens to have a microphone. So I just want you to know that the audio quality, of course, won't be at its best. But at the very least, you will have this video to watch. After a lot of speculation today, Airbus and Emirates have announced a new order for aircraft, which of course was expected. The airline has now removed a number of its Airbus A380s on order in favour of taking the A330neo and Airbus A350. Emirates will reduce their A380 order book by 39 aircraft and welcome their final A380 in 2021. This will also be the last ever delivery of the A380. They have indeed ordered 40 A330neos and 30 A350s to help with this. They've selected the A330-900 and the A350-900 specifically from the variants of aircraft. The Airbus CEO Tom Enders said, As a result of this decision, we have no substantial A380 backlog, and hence no basis to sustain production, despite all our sales efforts with other airlines in recent years. This leads to the end of Airbus A380 deliveries in 2021. Adding, the A380 is not only an outstanding engineering and industrial achievement, passengers all over the world love to fly on this great aircraft. Hence, today's announcement is painful for us and the A380 communities worldwide. But keep in mind that A380s will still roam the skies for many years to come, and Airbus will of course continue to fully support the A380 operators. Airbus will leave the A380 program behind, likely in 2021 with a number of happy customers and many fantastic travellers getting to experience the product on board, including myself, who has had the pleasure to fly on an A380 many times. However, it is worth mentioning that the end of production will come just over 15 years after its first flight, when in comparison to other Airbus and even Boeing aircraft, is certainly not a long time, and one Airbus would have liked to probably extend into the 2020s. The president of Airbus and their future CEO said, the A380 is Emirates as flagship and has contributed to the airline's success for more than 10 years. As much as we regret the airline's position, selecting the A330neo and A350 for its future growth is a great endorsement of our very competitive widebody aircraft family. Adding, going forward, we are fully committed to deliver on the long-standing confidence Emirates is placing in Airbus. Now, as I am out of the country, or out of my home country, I can't go into too much depth with this as I don't have any of my hard drive footage or anything like that. I'm going to be downloading it all for this video from YouTube. So when I do get back in around nine days, I will probably end up doing more in-depth videos on this news. So please just stay tuned for that. However, of course, I did just want to get this video out for you all as it is pretty incredible and breaking news. So that being said, I'd like to thank you very much for watching this video of mine and I do very much look forward to you all joining me in the next one. Race all of these broken dreams and flight And we'll fly